It's me and her. Y'all need to make sure at Battle Squad, whatever happens in that room, we won't know until she comes out. Whatever happens in that room, y'all need to be ready to have her back when it's time to hit that flow for the battle. So if she has any issues, which I hope she won't, if she has any issues, y'all should be able to make that up on the floor when it comes to that battle squad. Cameron is a great captain, so I just want to make sure I do everything I can and I'm going to support her 100%. We're going to go ahead and get started on the stands, though. Bring your ass. Come on. Diana has now put pressure on the battle squad. She's already done. Let them know they got to be ready. Yeah. They got to be ready. They got to be ready. Whatever they're going to have to be support all the way. Got to be. Listening to Miss Diana, tell the girls that they need to really be there and support Cameron. That made me feel really, really good because that's what she needs, 100%. And hopefully DDP leave me the hell alone. I'm not hearing nobody right now. I am focused on Cameron, and Cameron is focused in the solo. I feel like they're going to be a little bit more hype, especially if Cameron come out the room and she like this. Can Janae take one step back, you and Cameron? Um, Shakira, take one step back, you and Michaela. You should be up here. You're by yourself in the row. Y'all pay up. I've got two days to go, and we have to make sure that it looks perfect. At every other competition that the Dancing Dogs have been in this season, we have been preparing certain stands for certain teams. Now, we don't know who we're going to get A. B, it's dancing for a point system, and dancing to be scored by the judges. One and two and three and four, five and six and seven and eight, one and two and stop on it. Um, Imanje, Anaya, and Faith, go down first. Go down. Learning these new stands is hard. We've only got a few days to make this work. And if we don't get this right at the semifinals, this could be the end of our season. And one, and two, and three, and four, five, six, and seven, and eight. Faith, move up to the middle, and three, and four, right there, and six, seven, and eight. Going into the semifinal round, I feel like infamous dancerettes are going to be our biggest competition. We have competed against all these teams all season long, and the one that has stuck in my mind has been the infamous dancerettes. If y'all do what y'all need to do and what we rehearse, there's no reason why y'all couldn't be one of the teams chosen to go to the Battle Royale. Knowing that I'm one of the nine teams to go into the semifinals, I'm so excited. We have to make it into this Battle Royale. Give me power at the beginning. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, and four. Five, six, seven, eight. Coming into the solo, I have a male dancer. The infamous dancerists are here to show the world that male dancers can do it as well as the girls. You want to make sure you add force at the beginning because Cameron is not going to play, okay? I'm sure the Prince and Tigress captain is not going to play, so you want to make sure that you air everything you're supposed to air on that floor. So we're going into this semifinals, and we're, we're going to move forward. Give me an ID on three. One, two, three. ID! Okay, I hear first place going on. Let's go. Six, seven, eight. Keep going this time so we can move on. I've been watching this practice, and this is day two of practice, and I don't see much going on. I'm getting nervous. We need to make it over there, huh? We need to make it to the Battle Royale. This is semifinal week, and we're going to do this all together. All together, just like we're about to do this. Local. I don't know if All together. All together. One last.